the idea for Randy Rhodes came up uh, because I, I'm a huge, huge, huge mystery buff and um, Bruce Lee fan. So I decided that I would kind of write about myself. Randy is a little bit of me and all the other kids are a little bit of my personality and an amalgamation of a lot of people that I know. It all started with me being a little nosy kid. <laughs> I've always been the type of person to ask questions, so that's who Randy is, that's who all the kids are. And you know what the other thing is? We all feel like we don't fit in, and these kids fit together perfectly. So if you're a person who feels that you don't fit in, you're not alone. There are a lot of things that I don't know about crime solving that I thought that I did, and I had to learn how to do that, how, really procedural stuff. I had to do a lot more research on what the actual um, uh, outfits that the kids wear because you know as much as I want to be a ninja as much as I want to be a black belt in Taekwondo I'm a little afraid of being hit I wish that I could take the credit for how beautiful the book cover is Vivian Toe is an amazing amazing illustrator and she read the book and made these characters come to life so all of that is her and the great team at Simon & Schuster aren't those kids the cutest what brought me to children's books? Actually, I never left children's books. I've always read them and I continue to read them. They made me who I am as, a, as an actor. Uh, the adventures, I was poor growing up and I got to go all over the world uh, through books and that's because my mom told me reading was important and I thank her for that. The next book is um, taking place in Randy's uh, stomping ground of New York City. So you actually get to see her at work solving a crime in New York with a gang. That's all I'm telling you.